It's Wednesday. <laughs> My <laughs> dudes. <laughs> vlog welcome back so I found this recipe on Facebook I'm gonna make dinner right now so I thought we could do it together it's Monday hello hope you had a good weekend I went to Whole Foods I got these beautiful peonies oh peonies are my favorite thing in the world like I don't know why I'm just obsessed with these flowers and I hate that they're so expensive but I just try to keep them alive for as long as possible I'm also just like not over my bedroom. I just really love it. All right, so for this recipe, this is buffalo mac and cheese or buffalo bow ties or something. Um, so I'll link the recipe if you want to see how it is. But like you make this special buffalo sauce. It just looks really, really good with like grilled chicken. Yum. And this is my favorite water. You guys know, let me know if you remember me talking about this water forever ago. <laughs> like I used to be obsessed. Um, and they changed the packaging. It's super cute. So, all right, I'm going to make this. You guys will see the recipe down below if you want to. I'll let you know how it comes out. I'm essentially just making the sauce now with um, butter, milk, hot sauce, ranch, stuff like that. All right, guys. So, I made enough for me and my friends over the next few days. But I just tasted it. It is so freaking good. If you guys like buffalo, I'll link below the recipe. Good morning. Happy Tuesday. So I am heading over to see my friend Janelle. I did so much work this morning. It's been like so productive. I got up early. I have been making my bed every morning and let me tell you, it changes the game. So it's 1240. I'm heading to see Janelle. I put a lot of blush on my nose today, but I feel like it looks kind of cute. Um, so this morning I got a video edited. I did so much housework and cleaning and stuff. And then um, I'm excited to go and just have some girl time. I also have been listening to the Getting Curious podcast with Jonathan, Jonathan Van Ness from Queer Eye and it's so good and it's also like educational and just like fun and I don't know, like new podcast recommendation, highly recommend. Good morning, it is now Wednesday. Yesterday I just hung out with Janelle and then got so much work done it wasn't anything interesting whatsoever. But today I am going to be trying this new blow dry bar, is that what they're called? Like blowout <laughs> locations I don't even know um, but there's this new place that opened kind of near my apartment <clears throat> I think I have allergies <laughs> side note I mean I have allergies every year why am I surprised it's now allergy season my eyes are watering and my nose is running but I don't feel sick so okay but I'm gonna go try this new blowout place because my hair is super dirty and then we're gonna go to my grandparents house and we're gonna make Easter cookies and dye Easter eggs I can't believe like Easter's already here I'm not mentally there <laughs> like spring is here easter is here it's very exciting so we're gonna go have a really fun family day with mama fearless and my cousin and live our best life all right guys i got my blowout it looks so pretty just some cute little simple beachy waves did such a good job and now i'm at my grandma's we're gonna be doing our easter cookies and our easter eggs hi gert rouse i call her gerta rouse from juno <laughs> Gertel Rouse. It's really confusing when I try to explain it to people. A lot of people just haven't seen that movie. I know. So look how pretty these colors are. We only put in one drop of food coloring for each one, and they're just like really pretty pastel colors. Then we do little chicks. We have bunnies. Eggs. Is that it, meme? Right? Two bunnies. Two kinds of bunnies. So cute. So cute. Oh my gosh, guys, look how cute these are with the little pastel colors. They're so cute. They really do. They're like so pleasing on the eyes. It, right? Like I'm they so make me happy. They Is make that weird? me. No, I'm the same way. I've been like just like in awe of how cute these colors are. Oh, these are probably our best ones yet, y'all. It's all thanks to the colors. All right, guys, my grandma and I are at a Coles now, I'm having a little bonding moment. But uh, here's a clip of my grandmother. Testing a pillow, to a mattress topper. <laughs> We're 
testing pillow toppers and she wanted to see how it was. You want help up? And I was like, I can do it. And she's like, no, like, I want to lay on it. I need to see how it feels. And she was literally laying down on like all the pillow toppers. It was so funny. I love my grandma. So I thought just for like shits and giggles, we would check out the plus size section at Kohl's. And I'm really hoping this isn't it because this is how plus size sections were in 2000. <laughs> and it, it ain't good. It ain't good. Also, sorry, I know I'm chewing gum, my bad. But uh, this is a big no from me, sir. Like what? 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 No. No, no, no. What is this? Every. Like for everyone? I mean, that's kind of cute actually. Actually, I would like totally wear this. This so looks so cute with like jeans and wedges. Ooh. Okay. A few jeans. Don't really like those. Is that it? Is that the only trendy piece of plus size fashion in here? All right. I just don't buy it. Like I thought Kohl's was up to speed. Like am I missing something? This is like clearance plus size. But it's the same stuff as over there, if you catch my drift. Hmm. What a bummer, man. V disappointed in you, Kohl's. Guys, I came home to this super cute package from Aveda. You guys know I love their hair products. Look how cute this is. Um, a little book of self-care. And then we have a sleeping mask, which is actually awesome because I really need one of these. Sometimes um, the sun peeks through my blinds even when I have them like fully closed. Then we have a reusable straw, which I need more of. Um, I've been keeping them in my apartment. Then we have the shampoo. I remember I heard about this. This is really good. I think they used this actually when I went to um, one of the salons once. We also have the Rosemary Mint Purifying Shampoo. Yum. Oh, this one's my favorite, the Cherry Almond. Oh my God, this smells like actual heaven. Uh, what else do we have? Cherry Chai Almond Buttercups. 71% dark chocolate, yum. We have this cute little keychain. Oh! This is one of those cups. This came in one of my FabFitFun boxes. It like stretches out, I believe. But this one looks more like a regular coffee mug and it has like an opening and everything. These are collapsible. It's so awesome for when you're like bringing things on the go. Oh my god, it even has like a holder if you have like a hot tea or something. Oh, let me have this cute little bow headband. Thank you so much, Aveda. So awesome. All right, guys. Happy Friday. So, we're about to do a huge hair transformation on my little cousin. You guys know I have my cosmetology you're license. My you're my little cousin. I mean, you're, <laughs> you're not little, but you're my younger cousin. I still call you my little cousin. She's 21. She's old now. But in my heart, she's still seven years old. <laughs> so, I always do her hair. Um, she's had this like burgundy kind of ombre going on for a while now, which has faded quite a bit And now she wants to do um, like a silver ombre and we also cut off a bunch already, but um, Yeah, we're gonna first remove some of the color with this color fix Stuff from one and only and then we're gonna do some bleaching We're gonna do some restoring and then we're gonna tone it. So let's put in the color remover first <laughs> Alright, well while we do Greta's hair, <laughs> Gabby is here now as well. Hey. <laughs> We're BFFs. We are BFFs. The water's in the car, I have no energy to bring it upstairs. It's been in the it's been in the car. Yeah, we're back, to this. we're back to the pot in the fridge of food that's never going to be oh. removed. <laughs> this is what the pot in the fridge. Are you surprised? <laughs> All right, so we're opening packages now. How do you open it? I don't know. This one's from Tula. It looks like it's a new mask. Cooling and brightening. Sign me up, mama. Ooh, pretty packaging. It looks like cotton candy. This is so pretty. <gasps> oh my god, they even gave me little candy. Oh, she's wilding over there. Oh, and then we have a little headband. Cute. Thanks, Tula. Oh, my Lanta, are you okay in there? I'm fixing the ice so it breaks apart. 
Greta just told us bubble wrap is now made not poppable. I'm not okay with this. It's probably so the um, so break. That makes sense, I guess, but that's so, so sad. Yeah. We have some things from ColourPop. Look at these pigments. Ooh. I'm so bad bubble wrap. Then look at my God. <laughs> that's my mood swings <laughs> every three seconds. We got some Glossier goodies, which I'm so excited about because you guys know I tried their products a while ago and there were a few that I was obsessed with, like Boy Brow. I got you hooked on Boy Brow as well. Like mm -hmm. the stuff I put in your eyebrows. So, so good. This is real life time, guys. I'm eating Chipotle on camera. This is real life. Um, they sent some Lid Stars, uh, the Generation Sheer Matte Lipstick, um, some Body Hero Body Oil, Skin Salve, a bunch of really awesome things. So, there's your hair timer. Let's see if any of her color came out. All right, the good news is the color remover took out a lot of the red. We have like a weird blonde color. So now we, green. it's like, some of it looks kind of greenish, which it's I find green. fascinating, but not really, just like a little bit of a hint. So now, yeah, so now we can bleach more of it, tone it, and hopefully, hopefully uh, we can lift her enough to get that ashy tone. When your best friend has anxiety, so you lay her on the floor with your weighted blanket and a pillow. But it's nice down here. <laughs> All right, so I just dried it. This is the in-between now. I can't, it got a lot, a lot of the red out, thankfully. So now we're just gonna bleach it. <laughs> Put in a little protein filler to make sure it doesn't all fall out. Wait, what? Right. <laughs> Gabby's making Greta a margarita because she is stressed. And we don't have a shaker, so I'm gonna... <laughs> Greta, what? <laughs> no, not that sad video again. It makes me so sad, but also happy. Anyway, she's lifting really well, thank goodness. There are some spots from the she red only before. She the small <laughs> you made me buy that giant bottle. I didn't even drink any of it. My family did. Um, but this stuff, guys, is awesome if you're trying to lift quite a bit of color but not ruin the hair. It has some keratin in it. So it's from Ion. It's the bright white enriched with hydroxide, hydrolyzed keratin for superior conditioning. And it lifts up to eight levels. Like, look how much she lifted. So, um, Hi, all right, guys, this is what one round of bleach looks like after the color remover. Her hair actually feels really, really good, though. That keratin-infused lifter was awesome. So now we're just going to go through and lighten some of these parts where it's still kind of like orangey pink because we want the toner to really take. So, And some of the ends didn't lighten very well. So I'm just going to go through. And she's got like a nice, really blonde piece here. I'm going to try to get everything to like this color. So we can uh, get that toner on. But I like the way your roots came out. It's like right about where we wanted it to all fall. So, all right, let's do the rest. All right, we are watching Garrett and her hair is lifting really well. Of what? Hi, Erica. <laughs> love it. Oh, I love that. We talk about you. Hi, Erica, I love you. Um, her hair lifted a ton, we're doing good. Hopefully uh, this is enough to just tone it next. Hey. Guys, doesn't she look like Billie Eilish right now? I love it. You look just like Billie. So um, it took 13 hours. <laughs> One color remover, two sets of bleach, three different toners, and um, we got to the color she wanted. Water. Yeah, I don't know why the heat, my heat water not, isn't, I can't even talk. I'm so delirious right now, guys. It is one in the it's morning. Ice cold. Ice cold. I'm so sorry. But your hair actually feels pretty good. Um, hey, your towel matches your candle. It does. Anyway, her hair is what she wanted. It looks so cool. It's like a smoky gray color. And she looks like Billie Eilish. So fun and fresh. Billie Eilish vibes. <laughs> I just took off my eyelashes and it feels so good. It's so good. My allergies, guys, are so bad. I don't even know if you can see on camera how like red my eyes like so irritated. So it's Saturday night. I'm editing. I'm doing work right now because the vlog goes up tomorrow. I have just had a really busy week. I don't know if it even translated in the vlog. Um, cause I don't feel like, it's weird. I know this is really bad, but I feel like when I don't vlog enough, it's cause I'm just really busy. I like doing work stuff cause it's kind of boring. Uh, but I thought to wrap up this vlog, we can try one of these new Tula masks that they sent. I need to find a good spot to put you guys. Oh my God, my eyes are so itchy. Like, oh, I just want to itch them so bad. I'll give you guys a sneak preview because this vlog um, is coming to an end of that new little cloud 
addition to my bedroom. It's gonna be coming to a video next week. All right, so I'm gonna get ready for bed and do a little skincare. I think that'll feel really good right now. I just did an Instagram live while my footage was importing. So if you were there, hello. <laughs> Oh God, tomorrow is Easter. So happy Easter to you while you're watching this. If you celebrate Easter, happy Passover. Happy whatever, whatever you got going on. Ooh, she's so feisty and cool. <laughs> Thanks. Um, I'm excited to try this face mask because they're cooling and brightening and hydrogel and I'm V over tired. <laughs> My face gets really hot when I'm tired. I honestly don't know how we pulled off that hair color transformation yesterday. I was looking at the footage because I was just editing it and I don't feel like it looks as good on camera as it looked in person. But it's like this really cool, smoky, silver gray. It just, it looks like sick. So, anyway, came out good. I can't wait to take my contacts out. Oh. It's so funny, I used to hate watching people touch their eyes and hate like contacts. Um, it like wicked freaked me out and I tried to do contacts. I'm like so blind, like and now I can't. The closest I can see without it being blurry is like right here. Uh, I literally had to go to the eye doctor so many times. Sorry, you guys fell over, but I literally had to go to the eye doctor so many times where they would like teach me how to put in the contacts with like a little lesson. And I just could not touch my eye at all. So, you know, practice made perfect. I went back several times. Oh my God, my allergies are wild and right now. My eyes are so itchy and red. All right, I'm just gonna wash my face and then we'll try the face mask. Oh. If you itch your eyes, it only makes it worse. Ooh, so spooky. <laughs> oh my God. I will say it's in two parts, which I kind of like. It's easier to put on. But I'm excited because I have like that redness on my cheeks and this is supposed to help with that. So probiotics to help calm the look of inflammation and aid in moisture retention, papaya and citrus, Superfoods which give the skin a glowing, youthful, smooth appearance. Cruelty free, brightening, cooling, ugh. Citrus to brighten, yes. Look when I breathe. <laughs> Look at the nose flap. Oh my god. <laughs> Yikes. All right, I'm gonna take the mask off. I've had it on for 10 minutes. I feel like you have to use these kind of masks multiple times to like see sort of results, but overall though, my acne scars have been fading a lot. I've been doing so much, and I actually found out I also have like, um, like the capillaries. That's why I have the redness, but with the acne marks, I'm working on all sorts of things with my skin, which is coming within the next few months when I have them like fully under control. Um, but that's gonna do it for this vlog. Happy Easter. New podcast will be out tomorrow. Links down below. And I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Alright. Hi! <laughs> Hi guys. Welcome to, or welcome back, <laughs> to my <laughs> Why doesn't this sound right? <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back. We've had a long, hard, hard night. I <laughs> wish you would use any other words besides long and hard. <laughs> What's thesis? Guys, we've been trying to film this intro for like 20 minutes and I don't know what's wrong with us. We're a little tired, a little blurious. So I'm, I'm gonna put bloopers at the end, so stick around! <laughs> So we're here today to try Easter and spring snacks. All right, let's start with something gross. Something gross? Yeah, because we have like a lot of gross ones. We don't want to start with a good one, right? That's true. All right, ready? Birthday, Birthday cake, cake peeps. I think Does that sound springy to you? No. no. But is it in the spring section? 
<laughs> yes. How do they smell? I can't smell anything. Um. <laughs> oh wait. Stick your nose on it. On it. it. Yeah. <laughs> Inside of it. <laughs> this is not going well at all. I don't like them. <laughs> I don't either. I don't want it. So they're very confetti-ish. I'll show you. Except the confetti just like is confetti. <laughs> We're just weaving. It's just on top, like lightly sprinkled. Oh, it's pretty up close. It looks like real confetti. Did they just put paper on it? That's why you just said. That's why you just said. I'm so sorry. This happens with Abby. Like, you're so good, and like, no one listens to you. No one takes my advice. No. But then they come back and they say, My you therapist know, told you me know to what sing? my therapist just said. You don't take the advice either way, but. <laughs> it's not bad. It's not good. It's really not. It's not bad though. It tastes like a normal peep. I think that's why I don't like it. <sighs> yeah. Should we do something good or bad? That wasn't bad. It wasn't bad. A lot of stuff's hype, right? A lot of it's hype. We have bunny kisses, caramel. Do you say caramel or caramel? It depends on what it is. Really? Yeah, for me like, uh, like a bullseye or any of those chewy like caramel those are caramel candies but like the syrupy stuff I call caramel I used to be a caramel girl then I worked with Mallory and she called it caramel and I switched <laughs> it's Wednesday <laughs> my, my dudes, dudes. Ah! all right let's go These this bunny is kisses. bunny kisses caramel corn with white chocolate drizzle and pastel candy bits <laughs> the guy from that video when he's crying he goes, no. <laughs> he goes, it's quiet. He goes, no. Wow. I don't. Confetti pastel bits. Is that like a spring theme? The white chocolate's good. I like it. And you can see the white chocolate and cute little sprinkles on it. You hate it. You hate it. I couldn't bite through this. Or is it too hard? Mm -hmm. Do you get a cinnamon taste? Yeah, I get a little cinnamon. Why? Watermelon! Because <laughs> they weren't already open from the failed attempt. They smell great. Oh, my space pun is getting weird. <laughs> Sign number 347, why this shouldn't be. <laughs> They're going the wrong way, right? The faces are going the wrong way. They look like elephants. Look at elephants. Oh, he's so cute. Because doesn't this go back over? It's supposed to be the other way. No, it's not. It's not. <laughs> Why does it look like this? I look crazy. I think we are. All right. What's wrong? I'm going to pee myself. I'm going to go pee. I like this. Do you like this? I really do. I like it. Well, I don't like the aftertaste, no. It's sour. 